I'm up. Oh. Hey, buddy. Good morning. Good morning. Yes, I love you. Good morning. Dollarama for breakfast! Ugh. Okay, okay, it looks like we're on the, the Dollarama website. We got the eye tracker and anything I look at is going to be my breakfast. Oh, what is it? Okay, no, these are just categories. Trick or treat, school and office, home, food. I, I like food. I like I like food in the morning, right? That's what you usually eat. Oh, 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 gosh, what am I doing? Derek, calm down. Calm down. You're fine. You're fine. You're just gonna need a lot of chocolate for breakfast. That's completely okay. Um, okay, but categories. Basics. Ben. Okay, basics. You know what? We're gonna go. Some, let's get something basic for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a can of? Was that a can of ham? Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's um scroll. It's a, a very long minute. You know what? Let's not scroll. Let's go back. Um, I saw, I need a drink. I very much need a drink. Okay, beverage. Oh, don't look, Derek. Don't keep your eyes. Let's go to the right. Okay, I see in my peripheral something blue. Okay, blue Gatorade. Okay, I love, I love me some blue Gatorade. Okay, we got a drink. Let's, let's scroll down a little. And welcome to eating everything I look at for 24 hours. Here is our bag from Dollarama and let's have breakfast. Whoa, um, hey, <laughs> Editor Derek coming in here. We gotta add some money to the coffee fund. So before the video starts, I would like to thank our sponsor for today's video, and that is Crash Arena Turbo Stars, otherwise known as Cats. So Cats is a free mobile game where you get to participate in the World Championship of Fighting Machines. You get to build your very own unique battle cart and face off against players all over the world. The game is very competitive, but don't worry because there are tons of weapons for you to choose from to make your unique battle cart different from everybody else. You can also customize your cat driver with special costumes and like, come on. He's got a pizza on his head! You can join guilds to fight with your friends for special rewards, and you can join bi-weekly competitions that feature special arenas, like ones where there's low gravity, or ones where the floor is on fire, and... It makes it kind of difficult! Ow! 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 So be sure to follow the top link in my description, download Cats for free today, and give the game a try. That minute went by so fast, I don't even know what I looked at. Okay, I know I got a Gatorade. That, I'm not ideal for breakfast, but at least it has electrolytes, as people always say. What even is an electro? I just realized I looked at Herc in the beginning of this video. Does that mean I have to eat her? No, Herc, I will, I will not eat you, I promise. No, I will kiss you, that's it. Uh, here we have a bunch of chocolate that I looked at right at the beginning, our coffee crisp. We have our Reese's as well at the bottom. What's your guys' favorite chocolate? Apparently mine is f***ing all of them. Why am I always so mad during video? Why am I just always so mad in general? Could it be because I'm single? Could it be because, you know, I haven't had a home-cooked meal in about two years? Could it be because for breakfast, I'm eating goddamn candy? <laughs> <laughs> my throat is very, very dry right now. Usually I would have some tea in the morning when I'm feeling this sick, but all I got right now is Gatorade. I'm not gonna be negative, okay? I got my favorite chocolate for breakfast. I'm living the childhood Derek's dream right now, Reese's Peanut Butter Cups for breakfast. But you know, all of this sweet stuff would go so good with the coffee. The, the dollar store doesn't really have coffee. Good thing I have one downstairs in my apartment. Push the elevator button and um, I'll see you guys down at the Starbucks that I made in my apartment building, okay? Bye, love you. I, why am I doing this? We have 10 mini O. Henry bars that I looked at. Uh, all this chocolate, I think it was on the website because Halloween is coming up soon. And back in the day, O. Henry's were the thing that I always traded. I usually trade them for like Kit Kats or Reese's peanut butter. How, why is this white? I had a do the dollar store usually does <laughs> the chocolate has like a white tint to it. I don't think chocolate can really go bad, but I guess we're gonna find out. Like a 
it does taste like an O. Henry, but it also tastes like kind of dusty. It tastes like I'm eating an O. Henry topped with like grandma's ashes. Okay, let's see if this chocolate is white as well. Okay, no, this looks like a normal, just mini Kit Kat. This is my second favorite chocolate. So last but not least, we have the coffee crisp. The coffee. Coffee crisp? Wait, is this? Does this have caffeine in it? Hold on, hold on. Hold on, where's the uh, Sugar, wheat, modified, it contains zero caffeine. You know what? I bet the D Squad is just getting really tired of all my negativity. And if somebody out there hasn't joined the D Squad yet, you should you should do so and subscribe to the channel because this is a positive place where you know I get to open up a. Ca <laughs> oh! Uh, I get to open up a can of lovely to. <laughs> we're all about positivity here on this channel, right? Okay, let's crack that open. Never really seen tuna that like jiggles. Oh, it's tuna juice everywhere. We have just some nice canned ham over here that looks oh so. Oh, going back to the start. Oh. Let's add some of our nice salt that we got from the dollar store and some of the nice pepper that we got. So I really hope that you guys are ready for today's video. I'm gonna stop filming. You know what? This is going in the trash. Let's format the car. Hope you guys are excited for the rest of today's video. And here's to uh, here, here's to to positivity, and it's just sunshine and rainbows. Okay, so you guys know more than anybody that I respect the YouTube challenge and nine times out of ten I will try my best to finish all of the food put in front of me but Sometimes I have to draw the line when there's a can of ham from the dollar store like where do they find the pigs? For prices like a dollar a can, they're probably just jacking pigs from the pig farms. Poor little piglet, man. And yes, I'm washing my face to avoid pimples, but today it was extremely important to do this because ever since that breakfast, my upper lip reeked of just stank tuna, stanky, stinky tuna. And from this point on in the video moving forward, we're gonna try something different. All I ever do in videos is get extremely upset and yell at the camera, but I am going to be positive from now on. Everything is going to be fine. Like we're gonna get a wonderful place for lunch, a wonderful place for dinner, our snack is gonna be great, and our dessert is gonna be amazing. Especially, <laughs> especially when, especially when I'm sick, and also especially when this guy just off camera he kind of pooped everywhere. Sorry, I just had to dip in real quick again. I think we can all agree that we want more of Herc and less of Derek, more of Derek's dog. So kick that like button down below. And if this video can get to 100,000 likes, I will personally force Derek to put more Herc footage in the videos and maybe just make an entire video about him, okay? Very passionate about that dog! But Herc is more of a poop now, think about the cleanup later type of guy. Like, he's just, I think I taught him well, because I'm all about, you know, pooping now, wipe, when when I have time. <laughs> Guys, that was a joke. Um, and Herc knows that I, I wipe every time I poop, but you gotta make sure you wipe before you poop, because you save time that way. <laughs> we are thinking and being positive, and I'm gonna put all of my positive energy into finding out what we're gonna have for lunch. Herc, come here, buddy. Let's do this together. Okay, and for lunch, we are gonna have... <laughs> Herc, we're supposed to be positive. What was that? Oh, that was not positive. <laughs> I don't think Herc has yet hopped onto the positivity train. That's okay. Let's see which place we're gonna go for lunch. <sighs> Ikea. Ikea. Ooh, okay. Okay. We're at the Ikea website and we're being positive. Okay. I don't know, I don't want to scroll or anything. We, we you know what we're gonna do? We're just gonna search the word food. I don't know if there's even food on this website, but if there is, we're gonna, we're gonna find, oh, well, we found it. Okay, we got some cooked buller of meatballs frozen, frozen meatballs. Oh, okay, if it's not food, I can't, I, I won't get it if it's not food, perfect, okay. Uh, we have some categories here. This is very, very stressful. Um, oh, Ikea food, perfect, that's what we want, oh, okay. I still see them. We're gonna go to the left. Okay, Derek, let's just scroll. Don't go to war. No, you're going towards the meat. We don't want more meatballs. We don't want more meatballs. Let's scroll. Let's just scroll. Let's scroll. This looks like a safe place. What's that red? 
Okay, well, it doesn't matter what the red thing is, because we're getting it. Slit Lingon Lingonberry Preserves. That's great. That's great. That's great. Okay. We're also getting some frozen waffles and some elder flower syrup. Uh, that sounds like it's something in a Game of Thrones, even though I've never seen Game of Thrones before. I was definitely faking the positivity towards Ikea, but this smells and looks so good! Let's go! Yes! We have the Iguscal Sicilian No, I'm losing subscribers by the second. But waffles and jam, that's a great combination, especially when the waffles are little hearts. Oh, they're so cute! Also just kind of reminds me that I'm single. Food is usually the one thing that never hurts me! The last thing we have here is the elderflower, oh, drink concentrate. And there is also a fork in the bag, so let's have our lunch. I'm gonna get one of these Ikea meatballs before. I haven't had these since I was a kid, but I remember loving them. These meatballs are absolutely delicious. I wish I would have looked at some gravy while I was perusing the Ikea website, but I'm completely satisfied with just them on their own. Let's open up our jam. Let's spread that on top and let's give that a taste. Oh yeah! A lingonberry must be pretty close to a cranberry because this tastes like cranberry sauce. You know what? I'm gonna do something absolutely crazy right now. We're gonna take a waffle, put jam on one side, then we're gonna take a couple of the meatballs and we are going to make a waffle cranberry sauce sandwich. <sighs> Oh, lick my balls and call me Sammy, that's delicious! You know what? This creation is too delicious. I gotta tell the people at Starbucks about this. And before we continue eating, we gotta wash it down. We're not gonna smell it and ruin the surprise, but this is a drink concentrate. Here we go. Whoa! Holy! Wow! Holy! Um, I... I, um... I think I might have grown 20 more hairs down there. I'm gonna tackle as much as I can of this IKEA lunch, and then we have a snack coming up. Being positive is working out. Who knows, maybe we will get a coffee. I am staying positive. Here we go. So our Ikea meal was complete a couple hours ago. I'm just in the car right now with her just because we've been stuck inside all day. And I didn't realize or think about how dangerous it was for me to get out in my car and drive around because there are pictures of food everywhere. As we were driving down the road, I made sure to keep my eyes on the road because I didn't want to see any advertisements or anything because I don't know if the challenge is applying to my real life as well. Me and the little guy are just parked at a gas station right now because I needed to get some gas and we're going to head home. After how it worked out with Ikea, I'm going to be saying extremely positive for the rest of this video because I, I didn't know that being positive actually worked. That could be one of the reasons why I haven't gotten coffee in a video for so long and I think actually that Herc has hopped on the positivity train as well. This car is just full of positivity. And I would also love to know if you guys are going to try to hop on the positivity thing at home. So if you do, be sure to let me know. Comment down below. Whoa, oh! Oh! What, is, what the heck is... Oh my god! I guess it does apply to real life because I just looked over here just so I'd make sure I wasn't gonna crash and I saw an advertisement for two bottles of water and this bag popped into my hand with, guess what, two bottles of freaking es Esco water! You know what, I feel like it might be a little bit too risky for me and Herc to drive home because I don't know what other advertisements are gonna be on the way back so you know what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pull over right here and I am going to pull out my phone and figure out what our snack is going to be because I know if I do the generator and figure out what place we're going to it's gonna teleport me to the website and we're gonna be looking instead of driving. Okay, we've been putting out positive vibes ever since the dollar store. Let's hit the button right now. And for our snack, we are going to be looking at the website for Starbucks! Starbucks! Yeah! <sighs> okay, oh yes, okay. Oh, we need to get, we're gonna get coffee. Mm. Okay, here we go. Starbucks website, we're gonna, we're gonna press coffee, that's where all the coffee's gonna be. How many coffees can we get? That's gonna be the real thing that we're gonna have to, um, gonna have to find out. Where's the coffees? Brow, brow, okay, browse all coffees. This should be the menu. What's, no, these are not, where's the, where's like the iced coffees? Menu, menu. Drinks, food, where, where's the stuff with the price? 
devices! Coffee house? Why? I don't care about the Wi-Fi right? Oh no, social social impact? No, I don't, I don't, no! Oh gosh, oh gosh! Where's the coffee? Where's the, where's the coffee, guys? Where is the coffee? Menu, menu, menu. It sh it should be right here! Menu. Oh, I can, I can click on that. When you're positive and you're positive and just everything turns out negative. Oh. I see that there's a Starbucks bag here, but what are the odds that, you know, there's probably, if I were to make a guess, oh yeah, nothing in it. You no, know, I switched my attitude completely. I have positive thoughts. I'm doing positive things. You know, when I was at the gas station, I actually bought gas for the person that was behind me. I didn't actually, I thought about it, which made me feel a little bit better. It's basically the same thing. Yelling isn't good for my throat. This sadness isn't good for my throat, man. What is, what am I supposed to do? No, I would just go over and make myself a nice cup of tea, but last time I broke the rules, I, I didn't tell you guys, but my pee pee got three times smaller. Now what's my snack gonna be, huh? What's my snack gonna be? I wasn't even that hungry. All I really wanted was something nice to, you know, coat the inside of my mouth like a coffee. What am I gonna do, huh? Is this my snack? That's what you want from me! All this anger is making me very warm. Um, you know, now that we're here and we don't have a snack, I might as well just figure out what place we are gonna go to for dinner. Let's bring up the random generator. Let's hit start. And for dinner, we're gonna have to eat every single thing we see. Drop! Go <laughs> Okay. I've never been to the Gotham Steakhouse before, but I have heard it is the most expensive place to get a steak in Vancouver. Okay, okay. Um, lunch, dinner, dessert. Okay, I'm gonna go for dinner. Usually I go for lunch! Oh, but uh, uh, dinner is what we have to get. Okay, what is, uh, I'm scared to look. Appetizers, okay, let's, let's, let's stroll ourselves down. Let's get an appetizer. Fried calamari, okay, I love me a nice fried calamari. Okay, let's, 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 let's scroll down. What is this? The entree section. Okay, we need to get an entree. I'm gonna go for the very first thing. Tomahawk steak, There are two things I'm very scared of right now. One is to check my credit card statement, and two is to look down, but I'm gonna have to do both. Oh my God! Oh my God! I guess there's a reason why they call it the Tomahawk Steak, it's bigger than me! Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I guess I know why this thing's $175. Oh, and we have some calamari. Let's try that. I haven't had that. Oh, that's good. <laughs> and don't get me wrong, this meat quality looks fantastic and it feels fantastic too. But it's uh, the smells are kind of giving me reminders of the dollar store meat from the morning. I swear, if this tastes like the dollar store, you know what? No. Yo, no, it can't. We're going back to positivity. Positivity is the only thing we're gonna be. No, 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 we're being positive. I could eat this calamari all day, but um. We're trying to hop in the crack on this. I have to use my right hand to cut. It cuts It cuts really easily, actually. For all, for all you meat eaters out there, let's get a little cross section so you can see if they cooked it the right way. Um, I have no f idea because I haven't had this. Well, I've never had this in my entire life. Here we go. This is one bite of the tomahawk steak. This bite alone is like $20. Okay, I can confirm that this is a little bit better than the dollar store meat. No, I'm just kidding. This is actually really, really good. Like, I understand that a steak this big is kind of like a gimmick. It's like, oh, order this steak, it's $175, but this, it tastes really good. I don't know if I'd pay $175 for it. You can just like see the fat that's marbled in with the meat. Oh my, I'm a vegetarian and I'm drooling over this. I'm, I might have to delete this footage, honestly.
This steak and calamari combo for dinner is honestly amazing, but I am getting kind of thirsty. But good thing we got two of the Esca waters. I personally think the only way I'm gonna be able to finish this steak is without a fork and knife, and by constantly reminding myself on how much I paid for this thing, because I don't want to waste that kind of money. Gosh, my butt, my my butt, oh my butt! Oh, it feels like this right now is coming out of me. How am I supposed to get dessert after that? Oh, the tomahawk! Oh my god! Okay, well we still have to decide where we're gonna go for dessert. So let me just bring up the generator, and we're gonna see what place we have to go to dessert. Look at the menu. We need every single thing that I look at. I'm currently sitting here in the eye tracking position, but I think we should do something different for this last one. Instead of me getting a bunch of food that I know I'm not gonna be able to finish considering what's inside my stomach right now, why don't we do something good? And instead I'm gonna be donating $200 to the Greater Vancouver Food Bank. And they're gonna be using that money to buy food for people in need, courtesy of the D Squad, and they actually have really good relationships with food companies, so for every dollar that they get donated, they can buy $3 worth of food. So with our $200, they're gonna get $600 worth of food to help those in need. That is going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and sticking around to the very end. It means the world to me. We are creeping up on 2 million subscribers, which completely blows my mind. I can say thank you all day, but instead, I'm gonna end off the video always over the motto of do good, die great, and I will see you all very soon. Alright, bye!